Video 2, Measuring Liquids Using Laboratory Glassware. Video topics include examples of graduated glassware and their uses, proper pipetting using a pipette pump, volumetric flasks, and accurate volume readings using the meniscus. The different types of graduated glassware used in the lab include beakers, Erlenmeyer flask, graduated cylinders, and pipettes. Beakers are used for mixing and heating solutions and come in a wide array of sizes. An Erlenmeyer flask can also be used to mix a solution and comes in a wide array of sizes. Unlike a beaker, an Erlenmeyer flask can be stoppered and the solution inside stored. A graduated cylinder is used to measure out a specific volume more accurately than a beaker. A pipette is used to deliver a small measured amount of liquid to another vessel. The liquid is drawn up into a pipette using a pipette pump. Next we will demonstrate the proper use of a pipette pump. Carefully remove the pipette from its wrapping. Attach the pipette pump. Note that the markings on e the two sides of the pipette are different. One counts up, one counts down. Be sure to know which one you're looking at. Draw the liquid up into the pipette using the knob. When the appropriate amount of liquid has been drawn into the pipette, dispense it into the appropriate beaker or container. A volumetric flask is used to prepare solutions to a fixed volume very accurately. The mark on the neck of the flask corresponds to the correct volume reading. Next we will demonstrate how to prepare a solution using a volumetric flask. Take your volumetric flask and remove the stopper. Use a funnel to add the solid. Dissolve the solid using deionized water and fill close to the volumetric marking. Carefully add more distilled water nearing the volumetric calibration mark. Stopper the solution and invert multiple times in order to help dissolve the solute. Once all the solute has been dissolved, one can then add the remaining amount of water, ensuring the meniscus is level with the volumetric calibration mark. The meniscus is the curve seen at the top of a liquid, typically concave in shape. Measure so that the line you are reading is even with the center of the meniscus, as seen in this picture. 